I'm Steve Lovegrove. I've been a photographer in various parts of Australia for over 40 years, working commercially, uh, but now my passion is returning to historical and analog photography processes and teaching those to other people. In about 2013, after a, a, a good long period of, of still shooting digitally and still taking on commercial assignments, um, I be began to feel like my commercial career was starting to wind down and I wanted to get back into the darkroom. One of my favourite processes is what's known as a wet plate collodion process which was invented by Frederick Scott Archer in about 1851 and it involves the use of collodion which is a very viscous uh, chemistry that has iodides added to it and is then uh, dipped in a bath of silver nitrate which makes the, the uh, emulsion that you've created sensitive to light. Predominantly I work in the darkroom without a camera which is a little kind of counterintuitive for most people with this process who, who use cameras to make wet plates but I, this is uh, this is what I found I really enjoy. I had a collection of uh, antique tobacco tins that I had always wanted to know if could I make images inside these tins. Throughout my career, my personal photography is often related to found objects, uh, grunge things, things that people walk past that don't, they don't notice in the street, and that's continued. I've always been a collector of objects, and the wet plate process that I'm now working with have welded together perfectly for me. As a commercial photographer, and especially in the digital era, we are obsessed with perfection. We can remove things, we can add things. If uh, some, somebody has a blemish, we can take that away. It is not possible to make a perfect wet plate collodion. Every image is different. Um, every image has uh, artifacts and imperfections, and so that's become part of the whole process. So there, there, are, some, there are some small pieces of damage on the edge here, which are very minor. Uh, where the uh, emulsion uh, has got touched against something, but overall it's a very clean plate. I have learnt to uh, embrace the imperfection in the world and to see the beauty in imperfection. 